What is going on, guys? We are back for the finale of our Pokemon Glazed Nuzlocke. In the last episode, you guys, we beat Victory Road. We kind of sped through it a little bit. Um, honestly, you know, Victory Road's Victory Road. You know, mindless battles. But we are here. We have our championship team here ready to go. Uh, we have Blaziken, uh, who we do need to nickname. We did not nickname this Blaziken because it was a gift. Um, but we are rocking with the charcoal. We have, uh, we have Fire Punch double kick leaf blade and rock tomb uh basically um two stab moves and then leaf blade hits water and ground and then rock hits flying that's sort of kind of my strategy for that i don't have a rock move on this team otherwise so that's coverage there and i yeah um candy is still rocking the same moveset although i have added area lace in replacement of fly reason being is that area lace can't miss one two Fly is a two-turn move, and I hate that. But we do have Spore to be able to put things to sleep, and that's going to be very, very useful. Then we have Nala, who I've also teached Leaf Blade to. Uh, we replace Spark with Thunderbolt because it's just stronger. It's just stronger. Um, not by much, but it's stronger because of 30 base power stronger. Uh, so we're going to rock out with that a little bit. We have Crunch, and we have Leaf Blade uh, as coverage moves. Then we have Thunder Wave to paralyze things. Um, this will be our par paralysis setter in this uh, elite four run we then also have spore on to pangea with leech seed so we have uh, kind of like a stalling out tactic for some recovery with leaf blade and earthquake i could if i really wanted to remove spore at this point for rock tomb as well for example but um i don't think it's necessary um you know are we staying in on a nice move probably not so, you know, are we staying in on a flying move? Maybe, but I don't think so. So, next up we have Piercy, who is our toxic user of the team with Surf and Ice Beam as coverage moves with Tech. Uh, and then we have Serenity, who right now is a Calm Mind Sweeper with Shadow Ball, Psychic, and Moonblast. However, I did think about Jirachi. I just don't really want to use a Legendary in the Elite Four, or I guess the Mythical, but... Um, I wanted to use a team that wasn't like super super powerful just so that it was like a little bit more of a challenge We are leveled up to basically the final elite four members Maximum team level and then we have the champion who basically is like 55 through 57 ish range. So, um, I feel good I'm a little nervous, but I feel good uh, So if you guys are hyped for the episode make sure to like subscribe if you have it already this is the finale. Uh, what we're doing next after this project, I will talk about at the end. But uh, for right now, let's just hop right in and get this Elite Four underway. Kato! Wants to fight me first, trying to fuck up my team. All right, Kato, let's go. Let's see what you got. Sends out a Houndoom to lead. Okay, we can handle a Houndoom. You're level 44. Okay, we can handle 44. We are good there. Double kick right away. It's stab. It's super effective. Just knock this boy out one shot. There we go. Okay. Next. Espeon. Okay. Um, Espeon answer is technically Serenity. Technically. I don't really have like a psychic like switch in, you know what I mean? Um, which is a little concerning. But I think just going to Serenity, we resist psychic. That's what it's gonna go for right now, anyways, probably. Goes for side beam, so not even psychic. Um, so we do eat that up. And then I can just shadow ball. Goes for swift, that's fine. But shadow ball super effective. Okay. Does a decent amount and lowers special defense. That's a one shot if he heals up right now. Alright, so we one shot this. Perfect. Perfect. Critical hit and you're down and out. Alright. Of 
Feraligator comes in. Now, Feraligator does get... It does get ice moves. But will it have it? That is the question. I'm going to go to Nala. We have an intimidating Pokemon that is super effective. I think we should just go to that. Goes for scary face. That's fine. We'll, I guess we'll find out right now. Um, we'll, I guess we could Leaf Blade you too, though. I guess we do have a little bit of redundancy there. We do handle... I mean, it gives us two options for water types, so like I'm fine with it. But like, there is some redundancy there. Okay. That just misses out on a KO, but we get the Paralysis. Uh, so I'm just going to Crunch. Switches? Into Gabite. Okay. That is still... Okay, here's the thing. I'm gonna go out into Piercy. Because Piercy is our kind of wall for this team. Goes for that dig. Well, if you're gonna go for dig, I'm gonna go to Camula. And then I'm gonna Aerial Ace. There you go. Okay. So that knocks out that pretty easily. And then you have that PZ. And that PZ is scary because... PZ's always been scary. PZ's always been scary. Um, we're gonna go into... I think Serenity for this. Now I'm gonna Calm Mind. I'm gonna Calm Mind again. And then I'm gonna Psychic at plus two and knock this thing out. And then Feraligator's gonna come in and not be a threat. Okay. Okay, bye, Kato. Alright, hit me up. And I think that's showing that our team's battle scarred now. We are good to go. Wait. Yes. Felt a warm glow of confidence. Woo! Let's Tails go! Eat four time! Oh, she got a blissy. Ew! Rosaline! Oh, a new challenger. Welcome to the Tunod League. My name is Rosaline. And I love pink Pokemon. Shall we battle? Oh my god, this is a team for Shin. Holy shit, bro. All right. Okay, Rosaline. Rosaline sends out a Lickitung to start. Okay, Lickitung to start. Not bad. Not bad. I think this is double kick fodder, though. At level 46? Yeah, this is double kick fodder. I so badly wish I had Sky Uppercut. But I think that's 59 that you get it. Alright, we do knock that out though, right away. Okay, next. Is my Lodic. Okay. My Lodic. Um, could have an ice move. Could have an ice move. But could also have competitive. And if it has competitive, I don't want to go to Nala. So I'd rather risk... I'd rather risk ice move. And it won't go for it right now. That's the other thing. It'll go for water move right now. Which is a neutral hit on this. Hypnosis and misses. That's why you gotta go for Spore, my girl. Hey, we Leaf Blade you. Okay, knock that out. Perfect. In comes Slow King, who can also catch a Leaf Blade. And that's a crit too. Okay. 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 Come on. Next up is a Blissey. Ooh, we're getting grimy out here with a Blissey. Okay. We're going to least seed you. We're going to least seed you. You got all that HP though. You're going to give me all back. 
Ah, has ice beam. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Such a good thing that Blissey is literally the worst Pokemon ever offensively. Holy. All right, well, Spore is 100% accurate, but I don't really feel like dealing with that. I don't want to get hit with a nice beam, so we're going to go to Blaziken again here. Um, yeah, no, 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 no. All right. Goes for Ice Beam with Quad Resist. No freeze, please. Does have that leftovers, though. Does have that leftovers. Give me all that HP back. That's wild to me. That did so much damage, and that was like quad resist. Okay, Blissey. Oh my, the HP bar. The HP bar. Okay, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay. Down and out. Last month, five mons, man. And a chancy. Now, what's the odds that this thing definitely has an violate? Nope, no violate scene, and that is a down and out chancy. And all the experience here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, 54 we go. And we defeat Rosaline. Oh, no, my pretty pink Pokemon were defeated. Yeah, that's what you get, dog. That's what you get. All right. Next room, way harder than me. Okay, so. Ooh, this is... Ooh. Okay. We see poison. We see dark. We see those type of things. So, is this just a straight... Ooh, poison's scary, though. Poison's real scary, actually. Um, I think we lead with Gardevoir, just in case. I think we lead Gardevoir, just in case. Um... If it's Drapion as an ace, okay, I'm not saying in. A challenge. It's Magnus. Magnus Carlson. Holy shit, we're playing a chess player. Surprise, you beat that ditzy Rosalie. I can stop. Okay. 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 Arbok. Okay, perfect lead. Perfect lead. Perfect lead. Okay. Intimidate don't matter. And I psychic you to next week. Yep. Okay, perfect. Okay, next up. Is a Sableye. Okay. Get the moon blast. Get the moon blast. Alright, that should just knock out Sableye. There we go. Okay. Next. Drapion comes in. Okay. Drapion is a threat. Now, Drapion, though, has very little special defense. I personally think Moonblast kills. That's a sword scan. Okay. So, we do not outspeed this Drapion. Six levels up, we do not outspeed this Drapion. So we need this to kill. It does not kill. So we cannot stay on this. This is most likely going to go for... I mean, what do you think it goes for? Poison Jab, right? It's gonna go for Poison Jab? I would have to assume it goes for Poison Jab. Heals up the full restore at plus two now as well. Okay, so we are going to... We're going to Spore. Use a Lumberry. It's another Swords Dance. We Spore again. And now we Aerialate. Goes for Taunt. That's fine. At plus four though. Plus four crunch? 
Gets a crit and knocks out Crobat. Okay. Um, I don't have anything that's speedy left on the team, actually. We might get fucked up here. Okay, lower that a little bit. Has Earthquake and knocks out Nala. Okay. Who's my fastest team member left? Who is my fastest team member left? 109. 101. Bro, we actually lose here. We get swept. We get swept. This thing outspent Gardevoir. We get swept right now. So we are going to lose to the second Elite Four member. We're going to lose the second Elite Four member because we let a Drapion set up on us. Okay. So my best bet is actually to go Percy and Surf. And it threw. And then Gengar comes in. <laughs> okay. Gengar comes in. We have to live a... And okay, we live that. Mian Chao comes in. I quite literally have to go to Serenity. I quite literally cannot do a thing. Yup. Yup. Okay, we lose to Mian Chao anyways. So it doesn't even matter. We got the confusion and we lose to Mian Chao. That is how we go out. Just kidding. Just kidding. We defeat Magnus. Uh, literally by a hope and a prayer because we lose... We lose some heat to our squad here and that is a problem. That is a serious problem. Um, the reason that is such a problem is that we lost our fastest Pokemon and our Intimidator. We still have Firewater Grass Core, though, which is really big. But that is... I mean, you lose two team members, you're done in the Elite Four in this world. But let's be real. Um, in terms of what this next person is, though... I need a good lead. I need a good lead, so I need to know what it's going to lead with. Dragonite. Is this Dragon Trainer? Or are they going by color? Because if they're going by color, then it's orange. Okay, Dragonite's terrifying, and I don't have an answer for that anymore. Okay, so because I'm actually out... Because I don't have Camula, or because I don't have Nulla anymore, I need some electric move somewhere. So let's get rid of Calm Mind for Thunderbolt. I won't be able to do much about flying moves. But I do have Aerial Ace. That I could throw on Blaziken. Well, Rock Tomb is actually more beneficial. Okay. Okay, so we're going to rock out with that. And it's a Float Soul lead. Okay, so that's a good lead for Pangea. I need to just literally shoot you into next week with a leaf. Let's rock this punch. Okay. Should have known it had ice punch. Yeah. Having ice punch, I mean, that's obvious that this thing would have that. But there was nothing really better to go out into. Okay. And it was a lead. So, like, what am I going to do? Okay. So, next comes in Infernape. Now, Infernape could have Thunder Punch or something like that, but I think I need to play it as though Piercy can just take this on. And it looks like it can. Mock Punch. Okay, we handle that. Handle that. Piercy handles that. In comes Dragonite. This is probably multi-scale. But I have to Ice Beam anyways. This is Thunderbolt. Okay, that just kills. Sheninja comes in. Um, Sheninja. I'm gonna go to Blaze again. 
And I'm gonna fire punch. Yeah. Okay. And then last is Arcanine. So is this an offensive Arcanine or is this going to be a defensive Arcanine? Because that really does change a lot. Either way, it's a tough Pokemon for me to switch into right now. It is a tough mod for me to switch into. Um, I am going to have to attack it, I think. And Rock Tomb. And I get the speed drop, which is huge. But Howl's going to be able to sweep me at some point here. Okay, we actually get minus two speed. So as long as you don't go for that, I can potentially win. But it goes for extreme speed anyways, okay? Plus one to Serenity, live a hit for me to Psychic. She does. Okay. So that's three team members down. This is not going well. Um... And this is now a steel type person where I would have really needed Blaziken. Okay. So. Where I really need Blaziken, huh? And if this is steel. This is steel. G has got to be what I go out into. G has got to be what I go out into. Or I leave Percy and see what I can do. I think I'm going to leave Percy. Okay. Your name is Gr Gray. Okay. Okay, so Zorak lead. That's dumb, but sure. Um, We surf. We surf. Flamethrowers to nothing. Okay. So we handle this. That's one down. But champ comes in. Now my champ. I'm gonna go to Serenity for the. Get focus punched. Moon blast here. That gets a KO. Sends out Mightyana to get obliterated by Moonblast. Okay. Sends out Aggron. Um, I think I have to go to Pangea here. And I need to Leech Seed. Has Ice Beam as well. Okay. Well, if you're going to Ice Beam me, I cannot. Okay. I Surf. Get rid of you. And it's Ace... Is gonna be Skarmory. I can Ice Beam this. I'm gonna have to Ice Beam it to death, and I get a crit, and down goes Gray. Okay. And it's champion time with three Pokemon left. Okay. So, what do we know about our friend champion? What do we know about him? That's going to be effective. I have three... I have one physical attacker and two special attackers. I basically have to lead. We're going to lead with our starter. We're going to lead with our starter. We're going to lead with the one who got us here. And we know this man is a dark guy. So we are in so much trouble. Okay. So champion Blake with his dark guy. Lead Snorlax. Okay. Lead Snorlax. So, I am going to try and... Leech Seed you right away. Yeah. I'm going to Spore you as well and waste your... And race that for sure. 
and then spore again. And then I need a crit. Wakes up immediately, that's terrifying. Spore you. And get health back. Okay. Wakes up, goes for curse. We'll spore again. We leaf blade hope for crit. And we get the crit, we get back to full health. Okay, we are in a good spot. We're in a good spot. Team of six. Sends out Weavile. Okay, Weavile I can handle. Weavile is going to go for ice move. So I'm going to need to go to Percy. Yep. Um... Let me protect to see what it goes for. Low kick. Okay, we surf. We surf. Okay. Umbreon. Okay. Umbreon, I think... I can afford to go back to Pangea. And I can leech seed you. Now you have to attack. Cool. That's fine. I think I Leaf Blade, like, twice here? Goes for Moonlight. And then I Earthquake. There we go. Okay. So, relatively unharmed, Houndoom comes in. So, this is... I think I have to eat a Flamethrower. I think I have to eat a flamethrower to get an earthquake off and kill this. Okay. Okay. Two mons left. It's 3v2 now, and we have Haunch Crow come in. Okay. Haunch Crow for me. I think I have to go to Percy. Percy's the slowest, right? 70 speed? Yeah. Percy's the slowest. Misses the heat wave. I am going to ice beam this. Oh, I'm going to protect here. Okay, I'm going to talk. Okay, I'm going to protect. We're going to stall out fly. Okay. Shit. Nope. I misclicked. Okay, Serenity come out, and I need to Moonblast. Okay, this kills. This kills. And it's Darkrai to finish it at level 57. We have Darkrai to finish it. Okay. So we Moonblast here. What's for lovely kiss? Ah, no, we're asleep. We're asleep. We're asleep. Um, you're gonna go for Dream Eater, right? Shadow Bull! Okay. That's a problem. That is a problem. Okay, we pull the store here. We actually know that this outspeeds. So we can. Maybe we had a crit, we lose to Darkrai. Okay, well. <laughs> That's a little depressing. A critical hit Shadow Ball destroys Serenity, and we lose the champion. <sighs> okay, well, you know what? <clears throat> is what it is. Be how it be. But that is how our Pokemon Glazed Nuzlocke is going to end. Um, honestly, you know, good series. Um, short series though, but good series. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, and the game's enjoyable. Um, but what I think that we're going to do is we are going to be playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. That is our next game. That is our next title. Um, that, and I would also like to get going on Pokemon Conquest. Those are the next two projects that I'd like to do 
recording wise um and then i think i might try to do a live stream series at some point as well um we are getting kind of close to 500 subs as well so you know maybe 500 will do something along the lines of like a live stream series as well for that um but we'll see we'll see where it goes um i have a couple co-op projects as well that i'm still working on hopefully they can be out soon but um yeah that's all kind of in the works so um but once again thanks everyone for watching uh click like like the video subscribe if you really liked it of course we got very very lucky that this elite four run because we did not do well at the beginning but um but yeah i think if we would have had one more team member i think we could have beat that dark cry but it is what it is um so we're gonna get up out of here so thanks everyone for watching and i will see you guys the next